Hello YouTube people, it's uh, Lisa Stade here of the YouTube channels of Lisa Stade and Hitler Obsessed. I'm here recording from, uh, from uh, my college's cafeteria and I just wanted to make a bit of an updated video. Uh, I hope everyone enjoyed the uh, 14 part series of the 1974 uh, documentary that I did a review and reaction on of uh, Swastika. Uh, but no, I did promise a bit of a little video, or a little bit of a fun spoof or whatever, I guess. And, uh, if you look right behind me, there's like these little vending machines, and uh, I guess the. Move the camera up and grab. Uh, there, better look. Now you can see it. It's the, uh, that thing that I was saying was the meme. The uh, self solving meme. Uh, yeah, we got a new uh, little self-solving canteen there. Uh, this is not sponsorship for these guys. I just thought it was funny when I first saw it being uh, created. Uh, I guess it was self-solving. And if you notice some of those little things at the top of those vending machines, it says, smile, you're on camera. That is just, oh, look, a student. And if you notice, you can see the students in a natural wild habitat. <laughs> I probably didn't even know he's on a video that's going to go on uh, YouTube. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, so here is uh, pretty much a little meme that I told you about that was this self-solving kiosk. Uh, they do have like several like little options I guess. I tried to sign up for those fingerprint scanner things. It still takes, you know, you have to still put in money in it, so I think it's a bit of a odd thing, you know. If all the, every Christian thinks that, you know, fingerprints are the mark of the beast, well, you have to pay money into it still. Uh, which I guess, Book of Revelation, so you got some uh, editing. If that's what the rock of the beast is, a fingerprint scandal, uh, you still have to put money into it, so. Oops. <laughs> uh, no harm, no foul there, I guess. Uh, but you know, one of the options is yes, no debit, credit, cash, or whatever. But if you notice that, you know, one of the little things over there, I'm gonna point at it. Uh, let's see. Well, okay, my shoulder's pointing at it. Well, if I can stick my... No, my, my shoulder's pointing at it. If you can see it, it's right there. It's that little vending machine that has, I guess, the Starbucks uh, double shots. I one time rung one of those up to see, but, you know, but people might be paying for stuff. It was almost $10. I think that the college should uh, actually decide to put... Uh, uh, change the cafeteria name. Uh, it, my option is buy more public because it's very expensive prices. Uh, just like the buy more public. Uh, just no Adolf Hitler included. Guess that's our discount. Oh. <laughs> yeah. There's a little meme right there, and I've always kind of wondered. Uh, when I've asked people if they actually get stuff from there, they say, oh, yeah, they do. Uh, no, I don't know if uh, anyone there for pinch stuff from their stolen stuff because well, it's just a self-solving thing. It reminds me of an old uh, Lewis Wasserman video. It was about, you know, not giving uh, apologies or taking the apologies of a-holes. Yeah, I can't say that word on YouTube, so a-hole. Uh, about, lo uh, was it another technician guy called uh, Linus Tech Tips or... Is it's Linus for short. Uh, he ended up uh, going to one of those, uh, you know, back in the day when they had those Amazon self-solving uh, little stores there. Yeah, it was a little store. It's kind of like that canteen thing. And he pinched, uh, I guess it was a thing of tampons and we lost the, the number two over that, the poo over that there. Uh, but yeah, I mean, he was doing that for, you know, to prove that, hey, you know, the security system's crap. 
but eventually, you know, I was kind of wondering, like, oh, this is going to be a meme. Which is actually probably a good thing if you look at it, a meme. Because, yeah, we've been going through a pandemic and uh, things have been hitting hard at the college. This probably is one of my best videos, too. It's probably going to be my last now. Oh, well. <laughs> At least I have dignity like a good Roman. Uh, but yet again, I am planning to make a couple new videos here. Uh, I know this video was late because I was finishing up here at Swastika. So all the good ideas, you know, like, you know, you, you got to get everything while it's hot, you know. I made 14 videos of swastika and this is your quality. It's not gonna be the best today. Oh well. But I did actually look on, uh, I was looking actually online also of uh, another little thing that I was looking at. Uh, it was a, uh, was, I was actually looking on Google, just like I always do, just like everyone always does, uh, look at pictures of Adolf Hitler. Everybody does that. Pardon me. Who cares? Uh, I also wonder how many people actually studying and probably uh, doing the walk in this video. Just wonder. I have millions to see. <laughs> I think they just went crazy and <laughs> studied the vlog for <laughs> But oh well, uh. But I was looking online at a bunch of Hitler pictures. I wouldn't believe what picture that I clicked on. Uh, some other idiot just walked by, and I don't think he's even a student here. He's some guy that told up here. Uh, but I was clicking on a couple of Hitler pictures, and one of those things brought me to, uh, you know, they said it was gonna come back and make a breakthrough, and it'll become a thing because Facebook was dying or something. This was back in my high school years. And it still exists. It's MySpace, and uh, Hitler has an account, and it looks like, oh boy, I, I want to show you images of it. I'm going to show you screenshots of what it looks like. It looks like Hitler had no H1N1 or Rona, and just decided to spew over his profile. <laughs> it looks bad. It makes me think of, you know, what on earth if I, if I had Rona and that Hitler Nazi obsession of mine caught the Rona and decided to spew through my forehead, that might be what I'd be looking at, is that screen right there. <laughs> so I'm going to let you all guys go uh, and say, you know, this is Lisa Stade here signing off of the YouTube channels of Lisa Stade and Hitler Obsessed. Tell you to like, hit the notification bell to all, uh, share these videos, leave a comment. I, I love to hear the feedback, especially on the 14 part trash and tears of, uh, you know, swastika that never ended. I mean, I put so much into it. I got so much interruptions from my roommate. That's why I'm here on the college campus, because no interruptions. But, you know, get to see the students, I guess. Uh, But then also, uh, I'll make sure to uh, donate to my Patreon and my subscribe stall and become a patron. Uh, you can see my BitChute channel on BitChute.com. That's Lisa Marie Stayed. That's one word, Lisa Marie Stayed. Uh, do not see anyone else for the love of God. Or you can just go to uh, Brian Will. Just don't tell, tell him that I sent you there. Only troll by and will, but only see me on Bitchup. <laughs> not gonna do that, I mean. YouTube would not like me for that. <laughs> That's just a bit of a joke. Don't, please don't troll the guy. He's a neo-Nazi. He's not a good guy. Uh, but you can also go to my Facebook page and send me a friend request or a message. Or send me both on my Facebook page and my Facebook messenger of Lisa Stade. And I am about to say bye YouTube. Signing off here. And this probably wasn't my best video today. Oh well. <laughs>